when we originally located them, two of them were bedded. Uh, by the time we had decided to, uh, to go after them and worked our way in, two of them were lying completely on their side, uh, completely relaxed. So we made the uh, most of our opportunity and got in uh, to around 400 yards. I still wasn't comfortable with that range. We moved in a little further. They spooked, but they didn't run too far. We just held tight, didn't move. Once they started feeding, we slowly moved in again, got to under 300 yards, about 285, I think Fred was yelling out ranges to me. I felt comfortable, I put the crossers on the bull. Uh, my first shot looked awesome, uh, but these are big critters and uh, they can soak up a lot. So I jacked another round in the 308, let the TC bark another time and the, that shot put him down. There, Thank you, Jason. Thank you very much, man. All right. Freddy. <laughs> Thank you. Glad we could <laughs> out. Glad I could share it with you, man. That was a stock. We closed the distance to about 285. Man, they, they laid right back down. We just held tight and stood still. So now we've got one long walk back to get the sleds, and I think we got one 300-yard walk to see my uh, my muskox bull. As I walked up to the bull, there was a couple of things that uh, that I noticed. Uh, his horns were massive, which is great. Uh, they also weren't quite as